Hi, my name is John Kosteski and I'm a design manager for Hyundai Design North America. And today I'm just going to give you a quick look at our Genesis sedan here, our 2015 Genesis. So if I start off with the front, that's probably one of the things that you'll notice most is a new presentation of our proud grille. Um, it's a combination of our hexagon grille shape and our wing type grille fused together to form a very unique premium, modern premium design. So we've got the signature DRL lamps on the front of the car as well, supported by the by the LED fog lamps. One of the other things that you'll notice is the uh, trim piece that's inlaid in there and it starts from one end of the car all the way to the other so it really helps emphasize the visual strength and width of this car. If we move around to the side, one of the things that we're most excited about is the classic proportions of the car. So we've got uh, additional wheelbase that we've been able to add to the car allowing us to really pull the touchdown point of the cowl further rearward so the whole car has this cab rearward setting on top of the rear wheels, really emphasizing a lot of the, v the power of this, uh, in this type of vehicle. The character line that uh, starts off from the front headlamp and works its way all the way down the car right into the tail lamp is great because then we're using that to really hang a lot of the voluminous sections right off that line. And then it leads us right into our new fluid sculpture design language, which is more volume based. So one of the other things that we're really pushing with our, the evolution of fluid sculpture is the modern premium details. And the modern premium details are really coming through. It's all about precision for us in this evolution. So you can even notice right down into the inlay of metal, there's such a precise relationship and how it connects right into the forms of the car and then really streamlines its way all the way through from one end to the other. The, the way the whole upper just slung back as far as it can go and it's really emphasized with the sharp inlay of the metal trim through that to really force your eye rearward into the rear tail of the car. And if we move around to the rear, one of the things you'll notice is the same kind of thing we did with the front. We really wanted to give, give the sense of width in the rear of the car, so unless the tail lamp details really swing your eye outboard. We put a lot of three-dimension detail, three-dimensional detail in the tail lamp designs itself. You've got these little metal inserts that really divide that up and give it a very signature look, almost jewel-like in their quality. And the lower exhaust also helps really push out to the corners as far as it can go, helping really reinforce the width and the power of the car. The roof line, we pulled the touchdown point as far rearward as we could, so it really stays together with a lot of the sleek and sheer profiles that we have in our entire lineup. And figuring it's a sedan doesn't necessarily mean it has to be a three box design, so we really wanted to push the profile and get that dynamic gesture with the whole cabin just slung as far rearward as possible.